We are two days away from our next big 11 month trip all around the world. We're doing carry on only as we always do. We're here in our empty apartment. And so I thought I'd share what I have in my bag. So if you're doing three months, six months, nine months, a year, and you want to do carry on, this is the way to do it. I am made to be free. Okay, so first things first, this is what 11 months worth of stuff looks like if you do carry on. So we have a big carry on bag and then we have our little day bag. This will usually stay at accommodation and this will come with us out on our daily adventures. So let's get these open and I'll show you what I have in each of them. So our faithful followers will see this. You may recognize this bag from before. This is the PackSafe EXB45 that we used on the last trip. This bag's held up great. Um, and the first thing I'll do is we'll get into this top compartment here and show you what I'm gonna pack. Really simple start, documents folder, backup phone, two locks, one for lockers, one for that bag, and some plastic bags. Yeah, so just in this documents folder, it's things like bookings, reservations, copies of important documents like passports and air visa stuff, whatever. And now let's get into the lower part of this bag. Here it is split into two sections. Uh, let's get into the kind of the hood of the bag first. Okay, so these are the items in just the top compartment of the bag. I have a laundry bag, my travel towel, sandals, and glasses, both glasses and sunglasses. Now let's get the main section of this bag uh, busted out. Okay, so this is what's in the main compartment of my primary bag. We have my sort of puff puffer jacket, my down jacket, my ablutions kit, my electronics case, that's my raincoat, this is socks, underwear, and a headlamp, this is my tops, and these are all my bottoms. So let's break these down. So inside of my ablutions bag, I have tissues, soap, or nail clippers, tweezers, toothbrush, toothpaste, deodorant, Q-tips, and uh, some contacts. This is my socks and underwear cube. I have six pairs of sacks. Last time I had a mixture. I'm just going all sacks this time. Got my headlamp, got my toque, and then I have three pairs of darn tough socks and then one long pair. In this cube is all of my tops and my schmogs. Again, a little bit more than last time, but I have a long sleeve shirt, my schmog, not technically a shirt. I have a tank top, three next level t-shirts, I have a rash guard, a long sleeve button up, and a short sleeve button up. None of these are uh, merino wool or anything fancy like that. They're no technical or fancy fabrics. Inside of my pants cube, I have two long pair of pants, two shorts, and a set of swim trunks. Lastly, out of my main bag is my electronics case, so I use this repurposed GoPro case uh, to hold sort of everything. This is what it looks like inside, but let's get it sort of all spread out. So here we have a wall charger. It does USB-A and C at the same time. An adapter, USB-C to USB-C, USB-A to USB-C, the, our sort of backup hard drive and cord. GoPro, little tripod thing. GoPro, spare battery and lens. Uh, extra SD card, USB to SD. Of course, we're gonna be getting SIM cards everywhere, so you need a SIM card tool. And then I have classic headphones and sort of an all-in-one emulator. What I don't show here is I have a small set of Bluetooth headphones, sort of like think uh, AirPods kind of stuff. Finally, I have the things that I'm gonna carry every day or wear on my person. I have a hat, watch, set of clothes. Of course, I showed all the clothes with the other stuff, but you're of course gonna be wearing at least one set of things. I have my shoes, crossbody bag. That'll either be on me, depending on if we're just running out, or I'll just throw it in my day bag. We got our beautifully branded Wandering Blue Passports water bottle, and then my day bag. And what goes in my day bag depends, of course, on the day. So that's the carry-on setup that I have for our next trip starting in two days. So if you have a trip coming up and you're looking for some ideas, suggestions, how much do I bring, what do I bring, and you're a guy 
this I think is like a pretty good approximation of what uh, of what you might want uh, for your trip.